Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some Naya Slivers. We've got a good start in hand here. Strong. Very strong. I like it. We'll keep her going it's against uh, our Cavalo. We'll see what we can do. Let's see what he's on about. Ah, artifacts. I knew it was going to be artifacts. All right. Well, we got to move fast against these guys, and unfortunately... Uh, oh, well, never mind. All right, uh, I can dig this. Let's go ahead and drop our Viverlance. Pass. Put down a Lord next turn, probably. Or we'll uh, play our Blossom. I don't know what we're going to do. Let's just see what they play. Forger already. Well, that's a good blocker. All right, we're just going to be putting down Lords. It's a dang good blocker. Frogmite, absolutely. Absolutely. Can't move that fast. We're getting there. Probably see some removal coming up here, is my guess. We'll take a hit once. See what they do with the rest of their mana. Alright. Ash Barons. Uh, we're going to throw this down. Put down a Lord. Swing while we can. We can at least block the Frog Might. We're racing. What else you got in that hand of yours? Didn't play anything last turn. Thought they might be holding up removal like Galvanic Blast, but not sure. All right, we'll take four. Not gonna block here. What are you gonna play? Nothing. It's very interesting. Uh, let's Winding Way first. Let's see what we can get. All right, Viverlint. Looks pretty nasty. Sidewinder, you gotta Galvanic Blast my Viverlint now, otherwise you're gonna die very fast. Double Poisonous, third on the way. Taken all of it. No blocks. Should have blocked one, honestly. Definitely think it was a mistake not to, not to block. Let's see what they can uh, do with this fourth card draw. I don't know what they have in their hand. They have three cards in their hand. They're just not playing. I don't know if they're just a little mana screwed. Maybe they're mana screwed. Still attacking in. Okay. Well, I mean, you're dead, dude. Super dead. Uh, I'm not going to show them red if I don't have to. They don't need to know we're playing red right now. What can you do? Teamer? So, do you got one more thing up your sleeve? Or are you just trying to put me to three? Can you kill me? Oh, you can kill me. Oh, good job. Good job. Fling it. Fling it. Fair enough. Well, he had to win that turn. <clears throat> All right. Gleeful Sabotage is huge here. Oh, let's see what else. What else do I want? I don't think I really want Fireball. Don't really want Hunter. We can drop a Blade back. Um, Alright, we'll run it like this. 
I don't know if maybe there's more we need, but we'll see. Good job. Should have blocked. Should have blocked. Guess there's no reason not to block either, because we had lethal and, like no matter what. So should have just like blocked with one of my things. Uh, we'll keep this. This is fine. Try to get gem hide out and get cranking as fast as possible here. Didn't think about Teamer, honestly. I, I'd forgotten they play with it in their deck. Which is my fault. Alright. Nothing. Turn one. That's not bad. Let's crank this out. Pass. See what they do. We can drop two creatures next turn. Don't kill my gem hide. Don't you do it. All right, they're letting me untap. That's good. Let's go ahead and throw down a Sidewinder. Throw down a Lord. Lord may die. Might have a Galva Galvanic. Yeah, looks like. That's fine. It is what it is. We got refills. So if we pull into a Gleeful Sabotage, we can just tap everything basically with all our mana and just like kill all their stuff, which is like amazing. So it'd be nice to pull into that and get that line going. But they're cranking right now, so... I could easily throw down a frogmite here. Forest. Let's play out our stuff. Just get stuff down. I'm gonna take a turn to winding way, I think. Just be mana efficient. Nice. Okay. We lost a Gleeful Sabotage. That's a bummer. That's a bummer. That's one down. Haven't seen any creatures from him yet, though. There's one. Alright. Well, thankfully, we have triple flanking out, so we can attack into this thing. Tap in, probably drawing cards. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Serpent. Cool. Alright, so how do we want to ring this bell? Definitely put down a lord. Definitely put down another flanking. Definitely put down a virulence. Triple flanking. So this can't kill our creatures, so we can attack in here. Very nice. We out here. Trying to get it. Sure. Triple flanking. Boom. Feels bad, man. What you got? Cracking for a card. All right. Floating the red. All right, floating a green. Drawing a card. They know they're in trouble, so. All right, game three, here we go. Um, yeah, I think I wanna run this back. 
Let's just run it back here. I'm fine with it. Affinity for artifacts can be pretty nasty. I think I've gone up against this guy before. Probably have. Uh, we can keep this. It's not a hand that you'd necessarily want to toss back, so... Keep. The mana's right. We got the creatures, we got the lords. Alright, pass to them. Two dark steels. Doesn't look like they're gonna do anything. Let's grab our forest. Nice, that's pretty good. I think I'm just gonna drop a lord. Start getting some power. Gotta be mana efficient. They have green, so we don't have to worry about Galvanic Blast yet. And we have some good stuff here, so let's go here. I'll wait to play our flanking. Swing for three. Alright, this is the turn where they can start going off. So let's see what they can do. Found their blue, so they can at least get some card drop if they need to. Just gonna play Mirror Enforcer. We can attack into that, which is excellent. So if that's all they got, I'm pretty happy. Uh, let's Winding Way first. All right, all this is pretty nice. Just gonna play out this stuff. Flanking is nice here. Taking all of it, getting the poisonous. We got plated, we got gem hides, we got refills. Probably go for another winding way. Um, just look for another lord or something, or maybe more flanking even. See what they can do here. Also want to get out of range of Galvanic Blast too, if they do find a red. But we shall see. Yep, draw a card, get your mana right. So they do have that Galvanic Blast pressure now. Let's see how they want to do this. There's the red. Deals one damage to each creature without flying. So they can sack a ton of their stuff and kill our board, basically. But they just kill their entire board. So I don't really want to commit anything else to the board if this is what they have going on. They want us to, you know, suicide themselves on this. That's fine. Yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna attack in. They can suicide everything and kill our board, but it kills theirs, and then we can just play a bunch of stuff out. We can reset up. There they go. Sure. 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 All right. Could have forced them to like get rid of one more thing, but it's all right. All right. So we get a lord. Get a plated. Yeah, 
and they just reduce themselves to two artifacts. Yeah, I guess, I guess maybe playing a plated might have been best, because then they would have had to eliminate one more artifact. They would have been stuck with one more thing. But they, they suicided themselves. It was their last ditch effort. Uh, we were drawing at Blossoming Sands. We would have just played out everything else we could have. Swung for four. Would have been game in a second anyway. So that's how it goes with Affinity. Mistakes were made game one. We uh, we powered it out game two and three. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. Leave a like on the video if you did. Make sure to leave a comment as well. Let me know what you guys think of the deck and everything as we're doing. We're 22 and six now. We're doing good. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. And we will see you guys in the next video.